Told me can't still life, but I need a race strike. And these metals on my body. And these rings on my body break like new man coming up ahead on his own too. I might change my life Oh, for you Oh, for you Oh, by the diamond lane It didn't exist Had the Astro van And brought my kids through Brought the tea on the elders Throw the gilding on the children And the downfits Please rise for the Pledge to the Flag. Good morning, Cedar Crest. I'm Annie Gerhardt. And I'm Hannah Shirey. Today is Wednesday, March 28th. Coming up, we have a lot of sports news. Also, we have Mrs. Lutz in the studio to talk about Relay for Life. We'll be right back with this and all of your school news. class news, today is the last chance to get your prom tickets. Prom tickets can be purchased for $50 and you can buy them after school in the nurse's office from 2.15 to 3 p.m. To purchase tickets, you must have paid your class dues. Sophomores, if you have not, if you have not turned in your 10th grade health history forms, you must turn it in today. See the nurse for more information. Sophomores and juniors, Lebanon Valley College will host a two-day job shadow days. Spend the day on campus and explore careers in Counseling Services, Career Services, Office of Accessibility Services, Residence Life, and Intercultural Affairs. Space is limited in this program and registration is required. Job shadow experiences in the healthcare fields are also available through UPMC Pinnacle in Harrisburg. On April 14th, experience nursing in the OR, ER, Ortho, Neuro, Maternity, L&D, NICU, and other units. Free lunch is included in this day's experience. There is no charge, but registration is required. On April 21st, students interested in the field of radiology can shadow various imaging areas. For students interested in research, April 28th is the Experience the Laboratory Day. Stop in the counseling office for registration information for all of these opportunities. Freshmen, play, pay your class dues before the end of the school year. Dues are currently $25, but they will increase to $35 at the end of the year. Dues can be paid before school in room 208. In club news, any senior interested in directing a one-act play should stop by room 608 to pick up an application. All applications are due by April 6th. Auditions for one-act plays will be held in the auditorium on April 10th. 
All students in any grade are welcome to audition. French Club members, if you are interested in running for an officer position, pick up a petition in Madam Weber's room. Drama Club members, interested in running for an officer's position next year should stop by room 608 to pick up an intent to run for office form. All forms are due back by April 4th at 2.30. In school news, congrats to the Indoor Color Guard for another first place finish at Redland High School this past Saturday. The group finished ahead of five other units to remain undefeated in their class this season. Championships will be held Saturday, April 7th at Chambersburg High School. The Indoor Guard is the first indoor musical slash visual performing group at Cedar Crest in over 20 years. Congrats, ladies. Lebanon Valley College offers many summer camps for high school students in a variety of fields. In addition to experiencing college life, LVC provides community resources to inspire creative and intellectual thinking. In music camp, participants will have the opportunity to attend musicianship and master classes taught by acclaimed concert artists, composers, and conductors. In the health and biomedical science camp, lectures and hands-on laboratory investigations in state-of-the-art laboratories will introduce students to the fundamentals of mo molecular biology, pharmacology, immunology, biochemistry, and medical ethics. The actuarial science camps are week-long intensive programs for rising high school seniors designed to help them decide if they are interested in actuarial careers. For more information, visit LVC at lvc.edu slash academic slash summer community programming. So who wants free money for college? I sure do. <laughs> Well, there are almost 20 local scholarships, but the deadlines are coming up in the next two weeks. Check with your guidance counselor for more information about these scholarships. In sports news, the baseball team opened the season with a 16-2 win over Northern Lebanon. John LaBarbo was 4-for-4 four four with three runs scored and one RBI. Joe Carpenter was 4-for-4 four four with two doubles and a triple and two RBIs. Nate Trovinger was 2-3 and three with two RBIs. Kyle Foreman was 1-for-3 with four RBIs. Chad Ryland was 2-for-3 with three RBIs and a double. Chad also got the win with four runnings pitched and one earned run with four strikeouts. Logan Horn closed the game out on the mound. The girls lacrosse team suffered a tough overtime loss to Warwick last night 11-10. Emily Beard, Olivia Haynes, and Kathleen Steckbeck, Hannah Lewis, and Maria Brandt each scored twice in the loss. The boys lacrosse team fell to Warwick 13-5, John Luck scored twice, and Zach Kennard, Pat Hansel, and Matt Noster each logged a goal. Keeper TJ Moore had six saves. The swim team is going to the YMCA Swim Nationals at Greensboro, North Carolina. Gabby Towles, Cameron Villa, and Krista Weick will be competing in the 200 medley relay. Gabe Diederich will be swimming in the 50 and 100 freestyle. Krista White will be swimming in the 100 and 200 breaststroke. That's all for your sports news. The Relay for Life will be held in exactly one month at the stadium on April 27th. Event organizer Mrs. Lutz is in the studio to talk about getting your t-shirts and more. So Mrs. Lutz, what do our 2018 Relay for Life t-shirts look like? We actually had a student show us the graphic that she liked, um, Jay Getz was the student, and it's going to be on a purple t-shirt with a white writing on it, and the theme this year is Relay Around the World, so it's a picture of the globe and a student walking on top of it. I can't wait to buy mine um, and walk around the track, I'm so excited. So how much are these t-shirts? The t-shirts this year are going to be $8. And if you buy a t-shirt, you're going to get a voucher that shows that you already donated. So you can use that voucher to show your teacher that you donated. So it's kind of like a freebie for one of your classes. So when and where can I purchase my t-shirt? You can buy the t-shirts next week after Easter in the 200 hallway before school, Monday through Friday. Um, and during homeroom, we'll be out there as well. And actually, this year, Mrs. Gingrich's class is the team to beat. So they have already raised a ton of money. So you need to... Be ready to get on your walking shoes and donate some money to this great cause. Thank you for coming in today. Um, now back to Hannah and Annie. Thanks for coming in today, Mrs. Lutz. We also have a last minute birthday announcement. Happy birthday to Ryan Blizzard from your Aunt Jen. That's all for your morning announcements today. I'm Hannah Shirey. And I'm Annie Gerhart. Make it a great day, Cedar Crest. <laughs>